Hello dear students of the third prep grade and welcome to a new episode of our program. This is our weekly episode of science and on this episode we'll be discussing and explaining lesson one of unit three principles of heredity with our teacher of science Mr. Muhammad Mahmoud. Let me first welcome him. Hello Mr. Muhammad and welcome to the program. Hello yes sir. thank you. Uh, so we're moving to this uh, biology section of the curriculum. Yes. Mm -hmm. So uh, first of all, uh, we're talking on this, uh, in this unit uh, about the principles of heredity. So let us first explain what is meant exactly by heredity. Okay. Uh, firstly, uh, hello, sir, and hello, dear hello. students. Uh, so here we uh, we have to know how men how men, uh, is meant by the heredity. Here we talk about the. Uh, science or branch of uh, biology especially in science to explain the uh, transmission of uh, traits from one generation to another especially from your parents to the next generation we have some traits maybe appear and some or other uh, traits can't uh, be appear in the next or the second generation so here how can we explain the the heredity according to genetics here we have to know what is meant by genetics so here dear students we have to mention the uh, genetics as a branch of science branch of science explain the transmission of the traits from one generation to another and explain the similarities and differences between the individuals in the same species according to human or animals or plants so here dear students let's go to start our lesson today with the first point as how is meant or what is meant by genetics as you see here my dear students in the monitor we have unit 3 lesson 1 as the main principles of heredity so we have to know what is meant by genetics as you see here dear students in front of you we have a branch of science so here we talk about what branch of science that studies the inheritance inheritance which means uh, of characteristics or characters through the generations to explain similarities and differences appear between individuals of the same species so here we talk about the what we talk about the inheritance here we talk about what inheritance tawarif inheritance of what of traits or of characters through generations abril agil to explain similarities we have some similarities between the individuals and differences well appear between individuals of the same species so here we talk about what? We talk about the genetics. Genetics اللي هو علم الوراثة. Okay. So uh, can we talk about the different uh, kinds of traits here? Yes, so we, 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 we have to mention the main types of traits. Mm -hmm. As we, we studied before, um, uh, we have uh, some traits uh, as acquired traits. Let us also explain what is a trait. Traits. Trait is a character. Maybe this character is acquired يعني صفة مكتسبة or hereditary traits يعني صفة وراثية so for example as the, we know uh, eyes colors skin color hair color tallness or shortness as hereditary traits why because these traits are transmitted from one generation to another or from your parents to you but we have another traits or characters as acquired traits sifat muktasaba as uh, writing drawing playing football these traits depend on the talents not uh, doesn't uh, depend on or didn't depend on uh, the uh, hereditary here as uh, traits doesn't uh, or trait this trait doesn't uh, transfer from one generation to another مش just as a player or uh, football player like uh, Abu Treka, uh, he, his uh, son uh, is not uh, a good player of football like, like, uh, like he. But at the same time, we have another trait as uh, uh, 
hereditary traits, these traits are transmitted or transfer from one generation to another. As you see here, dear students, in the, in the monitor, we can classify the kinds of traits into two main types, as you see in front of you here, as the hereditary traits and acquired traits. So here we have hereditary traits, the traits here, number one, hereditary traits that can be transmitted from one generation to another. So here we can, oh, these traits can be transmitted from one generation or from your parents to you, from one generation to another one. So here we talk about hereditary traits. As, for example, as uh, color of skin, here, color of skin or color of eyes, okay? as uh, color of hair لون الشعر مثلا okay color of skin color of hair or color of uh, of eyes for example these uh, traits are transmitted from one generation to
احنا قلنا اليلو سيت دومينانت اه يلو سيت يبقى تاخد لتر ايه يلو سيت واي كابيتال طيب الاوبوزيت اللي هو ريسيسيف جرين سيد وات لتر فور اكزامبل هير جرين سيد وات لتر يس واي سمول يبقى ذا ريسيسيف تريت تيك ذا سمول لتر اوف دومينانت تريت هير وي هاف tall we have t capital we have what t capital as you see here okay and here we have short t small okay yellow seed has y capital green seed we have y small and so on okay We can deal with any dominant or recessive traits according to these letters. طيب يا مستر لو أنا مثلا عندي for example problem كده مسألة two p plants two a يعني إحنا عندنا زي ما اتفقنا مع بعض two p plants dominant or recessive. Okay زي ما قلنا كده tall short yellow green and so on. طيب يعني إيه بقى dominant trait? طب قبل ما نحل يعني ايه دومينانت تريت طب ما تيجوا نعمل بروبلم ونشوف هنحلها ازاي لو انا عندي تو بي بلانس وان اوف ذيم ا هنحلها على المونيتور افضل بدل ما اقولها اورال اوكي عندي تو بي بلانس وان اوف ذيم هيبقى تول uh, يبقى هكتب تي كابيتال تي كابيتال مستر انت حطيت لي تي كابيتال تي كابيتال هقول لكم دلوقتي يبقى انا عندي بي اللي هو البيرنتس اول لتر هكتبه بي اللي هو مين The parent, T capital, T capital, with other P plant short stem, short stem, T small and T small. Okay. The first point is what is parent type. The second point is gametes. At the end, I mean the gametes, and we know gametes have the half number of chromosome. So T capital, T capital, and each one of them in Independent circle. كل واحد فيهم حطه كده في دائرة واحدة. مش أنت بتقول جميت. Okay. And here we have what T small, T small, and each one of them is what in circle. يعني فصلتهم عن بعض خالص زي ما أنتم شايفين كده قدامنا. Okay. T small, and here we have what T small. So we have the last point is what is the first generation. F1 يبقى انا عندي 3 ستيبس اوكي اللي هو جيل الابناء فقط اه اللي هو الجيل الاول الفيرست اه جنريشن الابناء فقط يعني نوت ذا مثلا جراند سانز اه مش الاحفاد يبقى بيرنت جاميت ذن فيرست جنريشن وي هاف 3 ستيبس ان ذا بروبلم اوكي نكمل مع بعض يبقى بيرنت جاميت فيرست جنريشن ان ذا فيرست جنريشن هاو كان وي ديل وذ ذا بروبلم باي Making distribution like mathematics, T with T cap, T capital with T small, then T capital with T small, and here we make what T capital here with T small, and then T capital with T small. طب تعال نكتبهم بقى نشوف اللي طلع عندنا. We have how many individual? We have four individuals. عندنا أربعة هم أدي واحد، اثنين، ثلاثة، and four. Okay. So we have number one, T capital, T small, okay, T capital, T small, T capital, T small, and T capital, T small. So in the first generation, we have how many tall stem? Allah, Mr. Tall stem. 100% كلهم طول يعني dominant or recessive by, by logic which one will appear and which one will disappear انت قلت dominant قوية recessive as a weak uh, uh, trait صفة ضعيفة so here we have طول 100% in the first generation 100% are what are طول 
tall what tall stem so we have بس خلي بالنا tall impure tall hybrid يعني مش نقي خلي بالنا هجين هجين تمام hybrid كلمة hybrid which means not pure impure hybrid okay طب for example if we want to cross the two individuals from the first generation together نعمل تزاوج ما بين اثنين من اي اثنين من طبعا first generation to look for the second generation يعني مستر نعملها تعالى نعملها سوا يبقى انا عندي تي كابيتال تي سمول اهو تي كابيتال تي سمول with تي كابيتال تي سمول as what here as parent okay then we have number two we have gametes mm, gametes t capital t small then t capital t small and each one of them is inside circle كده كده Okay, as you see, like that. And we have F2, F2 as second generation. Okay. So we make what? This distribution between the gametes. Distribution between the gametes. Yani T capital with T capital. Hmm. T capital with T small. Then T small with T capital. And T small with T small. Okay. تعال نشوف مع بعض. For example, here we have four new individuals. Four new individuals. As you see here, one, two, three, and four. Number one, we have yes, T capital, T capital. يبدأ إيه? Tall, صح? Tall and pure. Tall and what? Tall and pure. يعني نقي حلو then we have the next one t capital hmm. t small tall and impure tall and what impure or hybrid يعني غير نقي هجين زي ما بيسموه يعني ممكن بني ادم تظهر عليه صفه وهو شايل ثانيه صفه ثانيه مش ظاهره عليه تظهر في ولاده بعد كده اوكي okay? طيب أنا بكلم in general يعني in plant or in, in, in human يعني. Here we have T small with T capital as T capital نكتب طبعا لتر الكابيتال الأول و small يبقى tall impure. And then we have the last one is T small with what? With T small. So here we have what here? T small here with T small we have short stem. Short and pure. واحد يقول لي يا مستر ما كده كده الريسيسف تريت ويل ابير اف ذا جين از بيور اونلي بيكوز ذا ريسيسف تريت از ويك ذان دومينانت تريت اوكي سو ان ذا سكند جينيريشن ان ذا سكند جينيريشن هاو ماني تول هاو ماني شورت از ريشيو از ا ماثيماتيكال ريشيو وي هاف هير وي هاف هير ثري تول تو one short as ratio is three to one طب ممكن نقولها بطريقه ثانيه mathematical rule كده ممكن نقولها مثلا او percentage percentage as 71% to 21 25 75% to 25% as percentage Dominant to recessive. From the two generations, Mendel uh, recognized the two main laws. The first uh, uh, rule and the second rule. But firstly, we will recognize the meaning of dominant trait. What is meant by dominant trait? It is the trait that appears in the all individuals for all the afraad of the first generation of the what of the first generation هتظهر في الجيل الاول كله في الفيرست جنريشن زي ما انتم شايفين كده فيرست جنريشن 
طيب what is meant by recessive traits يبقى انا عرفت ال dominant appears in the first generation the recessive trait it is the trait that disappears in all individuals in the what in the or of the first generation but appear in the second generation with ratio 75% to 25% according to the two uh, uh, definitions we mention what is meant by dominant and recessive traits from the previous problem من المسألة اللي فاتت okay من دل عمل إيه بقى ال law of segregation factor what is meant by law of segregation segregation معناها um, يعني uh, independence يعني or uh, مستقلين يعني segregation factors العوامل المستقلة أو ال مفصولهم يعني أو مفصولة عن بعضها يعني segregation factors or Mendel's first law يعني القانون الأول على فكرة we can identify the uh, the law by two uh, scientific term Mendel's first law or law of segregation factors عوامل التفرقة مثلا المف... المنفصلة يعني منفصل. okay so نخلي بالنا قوي واحنا بنتكلم على فيرست لو ميندلز فيرست لو اور لو اوف سيجريجيشن ان انا عندي هنا بيقول لي ايه؟ اف تو اندفيدوالز ار ديفرنت ان بصوا الكلمه دي ان بير اوف تريتس بير زوج يعني اه واحد يعني طول شورت بيربل فلاور وايت فلاور يعني في زوج واحد كونتراستنج تريتس يعني ضد بعض يبقى نمبر 1 pair and a and the contrasting okay the dominant character mm, dominant a sifa dominant character will appear in the first generation in the what in the first generation while the two characters or characteristics appear in the second generation with ratio 3 to 1 tiny if the two individuals are different in pair contrasting traits only dominant traits or characters appear in the appears in the first generation while the two characters appear in the second generation with ratio what 3 to 1 وجا بعد كده من ده العمل سكند لو برضه واحد يقول لي ايه ده على طول كده هنقولهم اه هنقوله ليه اسمه لو اوف اندبندنت اسورتمنت يعني برضه اندبندنت uh, اسورتمنت يعني الحاجات المستقله يعني برضه كل صفه مستقله بذاتها اللي هو مندل سكند لا ده السكند على فكره اوكي طيب بيقول ايه عشان تعرفوا ان الاثنين قريبين جدا من بعض very close to each other but we have one difference or two differences عندنا اختلافين بس برضو هقول ايه two individuals different in two pairs uh, in what two pairs or more خلي بالنا two pairs or more maybe three four pairs or more in the in the first law we said in one pair in one what in one pair so we have first uh, difference contrasting traits اقول له هي هي ما فيش مشكله اكيد ضد بعض contrasting traits only dominant trait appears in the first generation اقول له طبعا اوكي in the first generation while the two characteristics برضو the two characteristics appear in the second generation and here we have a next difference as ratio is 9 to 3 to 3 to 1 so we have two differences we have two differences between Mendel's first law Mendel's second law here we compare in first law we compare between one pair of traits hmm? and the ratio in the second generation is 3 to 1 but in the second law of Mendel we according to two pairs of traits as dominant traits and recessive in the second generation we have uh, 9 to 3 to 3 to 1 طب نشوفها ازاي مع بعض for example تعال نحل مسألة عليها لو انا عندي tall stem 
طول ستيم اند يلو سيد وخلي بالنا طول ستيم اند وات اند يلو سيد نكتبها مع بعض ادي طول ستيم اند وات اند يلو سيد هير وي هاف شورت ستيم اند جرين سيدز يبقى واي سمول واي سمول زي ما اتفقنا مع بعض اند هير وي هاف ا بيرنت اوكي And we will make a gametes. بصوا بقى ما أنا بعمل gametes هنا عندي two factors. يبقى لازم أخدهم. النص هنا كم؟ دول four. نصهم اثنين. يبقى T capital, Y capital in circle, and T capital in Y and Y capital in other circle. Here we have T small, and here we have T uh, Y Y small. Okay, Y small in circle, as you see, and here. We have T small, Y small in other circle. Or L A is an independent assortment. Okay. Okay. And here we have the first generation. First generation. أنت قلت يا مستر first generation كده كده في first law and second law only one trait appears or traits will appear dominant traits. Okay. طيب نشوفها نشوفها إزاي أهو. Here, T capital, T هنا مع دول, then with other side, and we will explain here, I will combine here together, and here we'll combine together. Okay. طيب, we have four individuals. شوفوا مع بعض. Okay. One, two, three, and four. As you see in front of you, we will classify them T capital, T capital, Y capital, Y capital. Y capital Y small يعني هيتقسموا كده T capital T small Y capital Y small T capital T small Y capital Y capital Y small So all individuals هنا برضه نفس القصة ولا نفس القصة يبقى all individuals in the first generation are tall stem and yellow seed but what But impure or hybrid, and the hundred hundred percent of the trait of of the first generation are what are dominant a trait as you see in front of you. So, dear students, here from these points we can classify the difference between the dominant trait and recessive trait according to the. طبعا مندل فرست لو مندل سكند لو. All right, I'm afraid our time is up. So. Okay, but we have a next next episode we will complete. Yeah. Okay, of course we shall continue. Just some exercises about the second law and about the first law as a complete choose and give reason. All right, thank you very much, Mr. Mohammed Mahmoud, for being with us and for your explanation. Thank you. Thank you, and thank you for you and all crew in this studio. Thank you. So that brings us to the end of this episode, dear students of the third prep grade. We've started unit three, lesson one, principles of heredity, and inshallah we'll be carrying on with this lesson on our next episode. So until we meet you again, we wish you all the best. Goodbye.